Hello friends and welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to make your computer, specifically your PC, using Windows faster. As you know, every time you install something in the computer, uh, more and more uh, programs take resources on, on your machine. And uh, what this does is, is that eventually you're going to lose speed and you're going to feel that the computer is really slow. And this happens in all Windows machines, it's just natural. And that's because every time you install something, there are new processes added, uh, and many times these processes are added at startup, meaning that when the computer starts, it needs to um, load a lot of processes or a lot of programs uh, before it completely boots or it completely turns on, so to say, in simple terms. So many times, the things that these programs add to your startup process are completely useless and uh, really should be removed. I'm going to show you how to do that and it's very simple. There is a shortcut in Windows that you can press. Is You press the window keys and the R you will bring this screen up, the ROM screen, where you can type different commands. What I want you to type is something called msconfig, msconfig and just click OK. Once doing that, you will have uh, the windows of called system configuration. Uh, just ignore the general tab and the boot tab and the services tab. What I want you to focus on for this video and on this on, on this presentation is the startup tab. So click on the startup. This is a long list of all processes that different softwares and companies have been added to your startup, to your computer startup that have to load every time you boot or turn on your computer. So you can see it's a long, long list. Of course, when you first buy your computer, this list is very short, and that's why one of the reasons why your computer is really fast when it's brand new. The more months you have your machine, the more software you install, the more processes and the more services and also the more items will appear on this list. So what you have to do, one of the first steps to make your computer faster, is just go through this list check the manufacturer. For example, I see here there is an unknown, unknown. There is a lot of Microsoft, of course. And Microsoft installs a lot of stuff. And there are many processes that you can recognize. For example, Skype. I have Skype installed and every time I, ins I run my machine, Skype turns on. That takes resources. And so let's say I don't want that, just uncheck it. So uncheck the box here of all the things that you really don't recognize and that you don't want. You see I have iTunes installed but I don't really want iTunes to be loaded every time I boot my machine. The advantage of having uh, some of these processes, each process will be will have its different functions but for example having the Skype on will make it easier for you if you log into Skype every time you turn on your computer but if you turn that off you may have to open Skype manually. The same thing is with the iTunes and uh, with other processes, but you see, it's really clogged. Like I don't, I don't need DivX to check for updates every time I turn on my machine. For example, that really is is a memory uh, memory increase that I don't need. It's the same thing with Google updates. You don't need Google to keep checking their website to see if there is an update for your your Google software, like Google Airs and stuff like that. So just uncheck everything that you don't recognize or you don't know, and just click OK and then restart your machine. You will notice that it really increase uh, speed in, in booting times and if you lose some functionality uh, maybe you check something that uh, you shouldn't have unchecked just again press the Windows key and the R go back to MS config startup and recheck those things that you f feel may be the cause okay and that will probably bring for sure we bring those uh, functionalities back but this is a very safe way to do things and um, if you feel that you have uh, unchecked too many things and you want to revert it to the original condition go to the general tab and just select normal start startup so all the device drivers and services will be started okay so that's it for today I hope you, uh, this tip or this uh, tutorial has helped you to make your computer faster uh, please leave me any comments and uh, thank you for your support and please subscribe. Thank you.